Hello, I'm Jesse, and tonight episode of Stone Videos, I will be discussing the Rolly Seaboard. Alright, the Rolly Seaboard is kind of like a MIDI keyboard. It has... It doesn't produce a sound by itself, like a regular keyboard would. So you need something like noise on the phone, on your computer to kind of act as a host for the sounds to come out of this. What all does it help you with as far as as a music instrument in the studio? It can help you produce other sounds like um, Driven guitar, a harp, flute, mm -hmm. um, desert sand is a good one. It's got an eerie tone to it. You can also buy stuff like the um, light block that has it's also it has like a drum pad. Like a beat machine almost. Yeah, that connects to it. Just oh, that's a good deal. Just connects these little grooves. Oh, I thought it was plugged in, so it's not even. Oh, that's no, slick as hell. Little little yeah. magnetic. Yeah. Bluetooth grooves anywhere on, on either side of it. even in the back oh, yeah, that's so you can connect several devices up to it and they even have a looping block and a live block to help you on live scenarios uh -huh. and a looping block to help you build a song out of scratch so have you actually used this in the studio or at a, at a show I've used it in the studio um, a couple times to help produce a song how did like what's the what's the quality good with? the sound quality is pretty good it um acts just like a regular midi keyboard mm -hmm. um the software i don't have the um equator software so i don't i can't vouch for how good that is but mm -hmm. if you want to buy that it's a 200 dollars. now for the people out there who don't know what a midi keyboard is can you tell them what a midi keyboard is a midi keyboard is a musical instrument digital interface it's an instrument that doesn't play sounds on its own, that you need something to drive the instrument to make sounds. So you need like a computer or your phone or some kind of software to help make it produce sound. Now, who is that made by? Rolly. R-O-L-I. Got a picture in that box. Let's see. And it says, but compatible with Apple, Apple and Android. Yeah. So then it's Bluetooth. That's, that's dope. And it just look professional as hell, don't it? This is just the 25 key. They have an 88 key, a 44 key. You can get a bigger C board and have more expression and more keys and like a full size keyboard. Mm -hmm. I don't know, from what I heard so far, like I was telling you earlier, it seemed like it would be a, a good ass like thing to use for scoring like films or short just short films or anything like that. It is good for long that. films, whatever. It just just the sound effects that he was playing, like sound instrumental design. sound design, yeah. That he was playing just made me think of like a horror movie or something or somebody creeping like mm -hmm. I was like, Oh yeah, somebody about to get killed. <laughs> <laughs> So what you can do, record your main. So you can overdub. Thank you. 
myself i would love to work with one of these in the studio could you show me like some more expressions on there yeah the keyboard's very touchy you, know, like you gotta press it down and it's kind of sticky so you can the you press down it's kind of louder again so you can slide it up and down and get it to go It doesn't work as well as the other keys, but you can have other keys and you might actually have a key like an actuator. But they're pretty sensitive. I mean, you don't have to hit it very hard. On some of the sounds, it's a little bit more of a sound. That's dope. Like, so if you stick your finger and kind of wiggle it, it plays off the wiggle of the fingers. Yep. That's sick. I like that. And that was the Rolex C Block Expressive Keyboard. A lot to do with it, a lot to know about it, but a good keyboard. And that's about all the time we have for you tonight. That was an episode of Stone Videos. Hope you enjoyed. Leave us a comment, comment if you have the keyboard, if you use it, what you use it for, what you like about it, what you don't like about it. What I did good, what I didn't do good. He's Justice, and I'm Courtney, and this has been Stone Visions.